Well, the group from St. Mary's Seminary is in Rome, and they're coming back to Cleveland with a message directly from the Pope. I spoke with two of the priests and Bishop Edward Malesic, who accompanied the group of sem sem seminarians, excuse me, to this pivotal moment that they had. All three of these church leaders described the Pope as very warm, compassionate, and noticed that he greeted each seminarian and even prayed with them in the moment. Father Mark Latkovich, president rector of St. Mary Seminary, says part of the Pope's message that resonated with him was the instruction not just to listen to God, but to walk together with people. But he says that doesn't always mean walking beside them. And one of the things that he said in his text, which I found very interesting for us as priests and for the seminarians who will be future priests, is he says, sometimes you have to walk ahead of people and lead and guide them. Sometimes you have to walk with them, beside them. And sometimes you have to walk at the end of the line picking up the people who are struggling. Whole church and to have Father a Joseph Koopman, who previously studied in Rome and met Pope John Paul II, described the joy he had this time around, watching this moment when the group met Pope Francis in person. See in the eyes of our seminarians as they came up these long stairs into the hall in which uh, they were to greet uh, the Holy Father, uh, to see kind of um, the awe and excitement in their hearts um, as he came through those doors and we all jumped up and clapped. Um, There's so much excitement. And to be president. Uh, at the he was sitting there next to his mother, Marianne, who was very proud of him, of course. Bishop Edward Malesic, you see there. He told me while many people have questions about religion as opposed to spirituality, he's learned the importance of community because it's hard, he says, to be a family or a church of just one. You know, my family, my, my natural family has its its ups and downs and its fights and its its dysfunctions like every family uh, does. So does the church, but my family is my family. And, and that's what unites us. And same thing with faith. A lot of times we've uh, not given or failed to give the basics of the faith, that our faith is about a man who was sent to us from God, who is God's son, who is God himself, who died for the sake of our sins. Uh, forgave our sins on the cross, rose from the dead three days later, and uh, said that you too can rise from the dead. We too can have eternal life, that we can have abundant life and a happy life and a full life if we simply follow him. The Pope Francis also spoke highly of St. Mary's Seminary and the large number of priests that have passed through its hall.